All right, guys, so uh, I'm going to do a quick video to show you guys uh, the progress I made, and then I want to ask you guys a question. So I got this little piece of plastic epoxied into the bezel or the gauge cluster surround or whatever you guys want to call it. It's epoxied in there. Uh, it's going to house three gauges, um, trans temp, um, air fuel ratio, and uh, boost gauge the openings where the heater controls poke through. So um, that's all staying in the truck, so I want heat. Um, that right there is going to be um, a toggle switch for the fan bypass. Uh, in that little tab, there will be a starter button, and then that one, there will be a button for the trans brake. Over here, I was going to mount a 7 inch tablet in the center, and then a gauge in each corner, which would be um, voltage, gas gauge, oil pressure, and coolant. Um, but now I'm thinking about leaving the uh, tablet out and mounting a speedometer in there. Um, I think that would look pretty good. Uh, and then for the tablet, I was going to relocate it to where the um, radio is now. Uh, they make a double DIN plate for that, and I would basically just install it in there. And that would basically act as my radio and all my gauges. And uh, I think that would be a real good way to go. Um, I think it look look pretty nice. Um, yeah, making progress. But you guys tell me, do I put the Kindle in here or do I put it where the radio is now? Let me know what you guys think.